Hello guys, what is up, it's Mace. Welcome back to Blazing Glazed. So today we are hitting the thrift, but we are not just hitting the thrift. We are hitting the thrift with one of my favorite people in the damn land, Carrie Dayton. It's just a couple of days before Christmas and I haven't seen Carrie in like a month, I think. We've both been like VV busy, but I'm really glad that we could figure out a day to meet up. She's headed over to my place right now. She's gonna be here in a couple minutes and we are gonna go hit up, I think a couple thrift stores. I think thrift stores we've never been to before. Her and I are definitely both trying to like branch out, try different places, see what goodies may lie there. And I think that we're gonna have lunch. We're just gonna have a girly ass day. We're gonna have a good ass time and we're bringing you guys with us. So if you are new to my channel make sure to hit subscribe down below we are gonna head off on I would say a holiday thrift extravaganza but you guys are definitely gonna be seeing this after Christmas but for us a holiday gals shaking shaking our teas around good ass time at the thrift okay let's go Okay, so we have just gotten to the Goodwill. This is one that I've been to once before. Carrie has never been. You look amazing. I feel like we look like the two Thank different, you. like, the angel and the devil on your I'm shoulder. I'm taking you to <laughs> Jurassic Park today. <laughs> Literally, she is the tour guide. We are right here, right in front of Goodwill. We have the most prime spot. And like mm. I said earlier, we're both not after anything specific, which is kind of amazing. I, I kind of love it. I feel like we just get to hang out see what comes our way. If anything's great, we'll pick it up, and if not, then we'll leave it. Exactly, and we'll fun. probably try on some hilarious things as well, because oh, yeah. that is what we do. <laughs> Let's go. Secret garden. Guys. Secret garden. I loved the secret garden, and like this, the circular, that's beautiful. Really nice. So I think we are first going to check out the shoes, because the first time that I was here, I found some amazing shoes, um, some Sam Edelman shoes, and some Uggs, so. These are kind of cute. Oh, those are really amazing. Seven and a half. I'm a seven and a half. Okay, you guys know I have to check out the records. Still collecting them for when we move. Loving this vibe. I've been picking them up like one at a time. I want them all to be just like my vibe. Look at that vibe. I just told Carrie, and she knows I need no more blazers, especially men's blazers, but then I saw that it's Valentino for $10, and I love the print. Like, I liked the print before I... I liked the print before it was Valentino, so, like, that's a sign, you know? Quite a couple of things so far. Definitely on a color palette, but I gotta say I'm most excited about this. Okay, so we have been sussing through things, and I have found, like, honestly, quite a bit. Of course, on a day when, like, we're after nothing, I'm finding everything. This little Anne Klein thing might be a little too girly-girly for me, but we will see. Oh, wait! This is the one I was oh. looking at! <laughs> There's so many! Yeah. We just got into the fitting room and it is so big. They both are, which is amazing. Carrie's in that one right over there, yet Nikki. And I found way more stuff than I intended to. This Nanette Lepore sweater, which I have like a very personal connection to Nanette Lepore as a brand. My grandpa actually grew up on the same block as Nanette Lepore's mom. And when I went to Teen Vogue Fashion University when I was in high school, he got me like a scheduled tour of the Nanette Lepore showroom. And I'll insert pictures right here if I can find them. I think they're still on Facebook. And it was truly like the weekend I fell in love with fashion. If you guys have seen my like fashion store, video I'll link that down below I talk about it there but I just feel like I have to get this because it's like so nostalgic honestly I found so many amazing things let's go okay it's like kind of adorable I can hear Gary in there I kind of love it it's honestly super slinky I like these kind of like kind of wide sleeves and how much is this it's seven dollars in a net Lepore. it's beautiful bada bing bada bang honestly it goes cute with these jeans we dig So this is just like an H&M pullover. And you guys know I don't normally buy like Forever 21 H&M like fast fashion brands at the thrift because like they're not good quality to begin with. But this color is super, super like my vibe. Like I'm in love with this color. I like this with my new hair color. And I like this with this outfit. So I'm gonna get this just for like a basic, basic. Okay, honestly, I love this too. It's just like a ribbed tank that's like kind of baggy and cute. Shit, I'm like really scoring today. Okay. 
This is the Valentino blazer that's literally gonna be $5. That is too big for me, but like Carrie said I could wear it as a dress with high boots. It's amazing, I'm gonna tell when I get something home with me. Carrie, yeah. do you hear this song? Yes. <laughs> Allie and AJ real this. Okay, so this is the first thing I've tried on that I'm not getting. You guys know I've been a cardigan hoe lately, and this has like a very Chanel feel. It's Anne Klein, I believe. Yeah, it's Anne Klein, but it's just, no, no. I was gonna try these pants on, but as you can see, there's a little hole right there, so I'll be leaving these behind. I also have these shoes to try on. So these shoes, I really wanted to like them because I love the heel, but they are a little bit too small for my feet. But I am done. I'm gonna go out there and wait for Carrie, and then I believe we are going to do a mother effing car haul. Of course, had to check out this sparse hat wall before we left. What, which one was catching your eye? This one, but then now that I'm up closer, yeah, it's and it's like. Great. Okay, definitely going to get this book, I think. A celebration of girls being themselves, strong as the new pretty, our 2020 vibe, absolutely. Okay guys, so we just got back into the car and we just filmed Carrie's haul in her video, so I will have that link down below. Go check it out because she got some iconic pieces as well as the iconic pieces that are living in this bag right here and I'm very excited to show you. So excited. Um, I'm gonna mm -hmm. save the best for last. First, I got this H&M sweater that you guys saw in the fitting room. I literally never buy fast fashion brands at the thrift because like, they're not good quality to begin with. So no, like, and the second you wash it, them, it makes me nervous, mm -hmm. but I love this color. No, it's like, so with good. With my new hair color, like I'm obsessed with this color. I don't have a ton of plain throw on. Do you know what like it kind this? of feels like too? It kind of reminds me of like a Yeezy color palette yeah, it's in a, a way. It's the like older mm -hmm. season Yeezy color palette. Mm -hmm. It also kind of looks like a Ritzia, but like not a million dollars. So we love that. We love not a million and this dollars was $6.99, so it was $7, which is like, sometimes I think of that as a lot, but like for something like this, I know that I will wear it to lounge, I'll wear it to bed, I'll wear it to be cute, and then I did end up getting this Nanette Lafour sweater. It was literally so adorable, I and I told it. you guys in the video room, and I told Carrie, like I have a connection with this, and I wanted it to work so bad, and looking at it, it doesn't quite look like my style, because it's just like a hooded, but it's kind of cardigan-y. No, I think it's, it's so It's kind cute. of cardigan -y. Yeah. And the sleeves are like billowed a little bit. It Ooh, fit me just that. perfectly. Like, like it's, mm. it was kind of like a shirt that just laid on my body and love that. I, I was very in love with it and right. it's so, so cute. I, I like the hood too. I think I like it's the adorable. Hood too. It makes it like more casual. I don't know. I, I think I just knew I was gonna get this regardless, $6.99 as well. But Nanette Lepore, like that is a designer. Like she is a designer to be respected. She is a real ass bitch. And I just felt like, I don't know, very versatile. Mm -hmm. I got a lot of cream and like muted colors. I which is so not me. I so love not me. the palette that I you am got. usually so much more loud and out there, but maybe this is like my, like winter 2020 color palette. I don't really She's know. She's coming down, folks. I don't know. And then I actually just Ooh. got this like plain, I don't know if it's quite coming off on camera, but it's a ribbed thick, like thick, um, what am I trying to say? It's kind of like a vest. It's almost kind of like a vest and it didn't fit me tight. It fit yeah. me kind of loose, but I loved it with these jeans and these boots kind of just for like a white top and mm -hmm. jeans moment. Like this with like a leather moto jacket or something mm -hmm. for like January, February, I feel like would be really cute. I'm, I find myself a lot now going through the white tank tops. I don't know why. I'm just looking for ones that are like that perfect, that perfect basic. These were like basics for me. And these are things that like I used to back in the day, like buy from more fast fashion brands. Because it can be harder because to find. Because it can be hard to find. Game. Honestly, for me, I have a harder time finding basic items than I do like my crazy out there sequin Oh pieces. yeah, it's way easier to find funky and stuff. And so this was, I, I'm very happy with this. And well then done. this tank was only $4, $3.99. So very cool. about I it. Love. Then I, I'm green, 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 green. green. I, we're, we're manifesting money in 2020. We're manifesting Ooh. all the green. So I just, I love this green and it's a like, like a men's style shimmy shake top. It's like a classic shimmy shake top, if you will. And I honestly picked this up to get it for Tyler and then I tried it on, I liked it for myself. So I think we, we can, <laughs> you can share. We can share, but I, I had it, it on in the fitting room over this <gasps> and it was like Cute. a really, it was a good vibe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really loved that I wanna color. say this was, Six ninety nine as well. We both literally thrifted designer blazers in the men's department. The second we walked in there, I saw this one. And before I even saw what brand it was, which is how I know I love it. Yes. Sometimes I do question when I'm at the thrift, do I want to buy this just because it's designer? It's hard to say no to those things when it's like $7 for a Dolce & Gabbana like, sweatshirt because yeah. you're like, I should want to buy it. Um, so I no, knew I loved guess. this. When you, I like, guess. Literally were like, <gasps> so I turned the, like, the lapel around and it's Valentino. Uh, it was... Uh, 
$9.99. So already we were freaking out. Sold. Already we were freaking Sold. out. And then we saw that mm -hmm. color of the week was blue. So Carrie and I were just kind of, we weren't like thinking and we were just like, oh, it's 50% off. So I was like, oh my God, it's gonna be $5. And then we got into the car and I looked at my receipt and I realized that it was $1. A dollar. My Valentino oversized, beautiful ass, made in Italy blazer. Literally made in Italy. What was one dollar? One dollar. One like, doll hair. Like, that just made I, the whole day a I million think this times is better. My like, this is one of the best things I've thrifted in a minute. I think in terms of just like bang for your damn buck. Uh, and that's so exciting too. That's like what makes you fall in love this with thrifting. Is, you know, that, this is what made me fall in love with thrifting. Ooh, like literally ten years ago was being able to like go into the thrift store and find just this for a dollar like i'm just i'm i'm psyched on this and i'm gonna get home and tyler's gonna be like you didn't need any more blazers i'm gonna be like but it was valentino and it was a dollar so that's that Incredible. last thing i got was this book i love it you know i am the oldest of two younger gals and i just felt like i had to get this book so maybe keep it for myself as a coffee table book and maybe keep it for my future child one day because it says strong is the new pretty a celebration of girls being themselves you guys know that we're all about just being our beautiful ass queen selves on blazed and glazed so yes. i just feel like this book is the move i mean like this gal right here getting her foot Ball on, like, yes, go for queen. it, queen. Like, yes, yes, queen. Like, I don't know. Every picture I turn to, I'm just like, get it, girl. Mm -hmm. So, I Strong had to get this. Pretty, and it was only like three dollars. Girls being fearless, girls being silly, girls being wild, stubborn, and proud. Yes, that's I feel like us. that describes both yeah, of us. It does. Team. It does. I love it. So, I am honestly just so jazzed out of my damn tap shoes. On we're literally like went. about to do cartwheels right now. Like, we're both like so in. We're just in a good mood, and mm -hmm. this was one of those days that like just reminds you like this is why I love thrifting. Like, it's mm -hmm. a good ass time to go with your friends and just perfection. Such so, a good day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a big thumbs up leave us a comment down below letting me know like your favorite thing of the whole entire haul make sure you go check out carrie's video because like i said we found like equal item like i feel like we just found like equal level items and it was just such a good, good stuff. ass time for all great thrifting day great all around don't forget that you are a beautiful ass queen and no matter what just the way you are and no one can take that away from you we are going into 2020 being ourselves doing us for us and that's the damn tea on that i love you guys so much and we'll see you guys next time peace peace <laughs>